Hey everyone, have you ever wondered what position you should be sleeping in? Well, that's what today's video is all about. I hope you find it really helpful. And if you do, please do me the favor of subscribing to my channel. As a doctor of physical therapy, I get the question quite frequently about what position should I be sleeping in, what type of mattress should I be using, and what type of pillow should I be using? Well, a lot of this depends on an individual's preferences, but there are some general guidelines and principles that I'll be addressing in this video that hopefully should be really helpful. First of all, a firm mattress and pillow is much better than a soft. The reason why this is, is that part of what we're trying to do in our sleep is to maintain what's called a neutral spine. A neutral spine means that your head and your low back, your entire spine is in alignment, is straight. Meaning, for example, that you're not using so many pillows that you're really far up or not using you know, so few pillows that your head's coming down towards the bed during the night, both of which can place a lot of tension and stress upon the spine. Do yourself a favor and don't ever go to sleep on your stomach. Even for naps, it's just a very dysfunctional position for your spine and it's doing yourself more harm than any kind of resting benefit. Never sleep on your stomach. So the two positions that really anyone should sleep in is either on our backs or on our sides. If we sleep on our back, we need a thick, thick pillow underneath our knees. Why this is, is that if we don't have the thick pillow and we're sleeping with our legs straight out, we lose our lordotic curve or that curve in your lower back that we're trying to keep and maintain at all times. So we don't wanna lay straight down. Instead, we wanna use a pillow below the knees. So when sleeping on your side, it's key to use a firm pillow and also a thick pillow between the knees. Now keep in mind, you know, this is not a very thin pillow, this is a thick pillow because when you put the weight of your legs on top of it, it's going to compress that pillow and if you use something very thin, it's not going to provide you with much support or benefit. Now what you can also do that I like to do is add in an additional pillow for your upper body. So you're kind of hugging that pillow. And the reason why that is, is it helps to keep your spine from twisting, either forward or back. What type of pillow should you use when you sleep? Well, I would actually recommend a pillow that's this shape. Uh, this is a pillow by Sleep Innovations that I found to be really helpful over the years. Uh, as you can see, this groove in the middle um, allows to support the head very effectively and it really helped to maintain what's called that neutral spine that I was referring to earlier. Some people like to sleep with too much neck support, two pillows or maybe even three pillows. I highly recommend not using this technique. What that would look like is this. And as you can see, I'm not in that neutral spine anymore. Instead, my head is too elevated. This le will lead over time to a muscular imbalance between this side and this side. As you can see, it requires quite a few pillows to sleep in the right position, but it's really highly critically important that you do so. Now that we're living so much longer lives than we used to, it's really important that we keep our spines healthy as we age, and sleeping in the right position is a big part of this. So this video has been all about what position should you sleep in that's best for your body and for the health of your spine, but there are so many different topics I could post about. It all depends on what you guys would like to see. So please do me the favor and post your comments below and subscribe so I can do my best to create a meaningful video for you or for a loved one to improve quality of life. This is Dr. John Mayo, physical therapist. Really hoping you guys enjoyed the video. I'll keep it coming. Uh, please let me know if you have anything you guys would like me to cover.